very, 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 very
that is crazy. The first time somebody told me that, I don't know, I thought they were bullshit. So, boom, I shot him. The thing is, <laughs> he was right. And then I started seeing it everywhere I looked. Everywhere I looked, all these fucking pricks. Everywhere I looked, doing the exact same fucking thing. Over and over and over and over and over again. Thinking, this time, it's gonna be different. No, 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 please. This time, it's gonna be different. I'm sorry. I don't like the way you are looking at it. Okay? You have a fucking problem in your head. You think I'm pushing you? You think I'm lying? Yeah, this is something that we already had in the pipeline. And, you know, we didn't even think that this, you know, would have come out like this. And that people would, would like, basically be, like, thinking that this is something that's that's right now. But I guess that's what's happened. So he goes, I just want you to know, I'm so sorry. We didn't mean to, to make it be, like, an insult to you. And we've, we've taken down the clip. And I was like, I read it. And I went back to Andy. I was like, dude. Relax. It's fine. I don't care. This doesn't bother me in the least. I already knew you guys had made these kind of comments about me before and these clips. You're not the first. You're not the last. Since then, things have changed. Has it not? We've met each other. We've talked. We've hung out. We've had a good time together. And you guys have publicly apologized for this behavior. So why would I care? Right? Like, why is this such a big deal? But I guess Andy was afraid because, you know what it is. It's my haters. My stupid detroit. And we're back. This is my problem. Man, move your bitch and bitch ass over, bitch. What, power level of five? Shit, ain't nobody got time for that. Well, that ain't right. <laughs> Mudahar put out a video on his channel explaining what actually happened. Okay? And... Basically, in a nutshell, we will I'm not gonna watch 13 minutes of this. In a nutshell, he explains that basically he's had enough of Twitter. That, or or I should say X, because that's really the, 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 the real name of it now, right? That basically X has become a toxic cesspool. Every time he goes on there, he's got a million people insulting him about his race, which is fucked up. I mean, he's Indian, right? People are saying these horrible slurs about him and stuff. And he's just had enough of it. Like he says, I get content from, from X, don't get me wrong. But it seems like increasingly it's very more polarized. It's either ultimate all the way to the left or ultimate all the way to the right. Everyone's always at each other's throats and accusing you of being the villain. And and basically he's had enough of having this kind of extremist behavior being thrown at him. You know? Now listen, to, I 100% I feel you make me angry, Phil. And I apologize. Dear Dark. Whoa. Almost replayed it. Okay. So that's it in its entirety. Unedited, no commentary from me on it whatsoever. I, I felt like the best way to approach it would be to do an honest playing of what it is. So you guys now have heard what he had to say. And you can judge for yourself. Okay. By the way, I'm being told the documentary he was watching was by someone called Mikey No H More. Mikey N O H M O R E. So it was, I guess now, that June opened the floodgates with his documentary. You're going to see a ton of rich documentaries coming out there, I would guess, right? Okay. A couple quick shout-outs, by the way. Some Kind of Taco did a $5 super chat. Hit the like button. Yes, thank you. And did we hit it? We're 234 likes, guys. We have almost 700 viewers. Let's hit 250 likes right now. All right? Thank you, guys. Um, all right. And Helly interested in super chat. Because I know you game isn't for you. I know the game isn't for you. Could you see yourself trying out Monster Hunter Wilds in 2025? Uh, it's a maybe. I'm not I'm not disinterested in it. I like the Monster Hunter universe. But as I said many times, I tried playing the beta of Monster Hunter, whatever the last one was, uh, World, years ago, and no one liked it. People literally told me on my stream, stop playing this beta. It's incredibly boring. And I, I only played it the one stream, and that was it. So really, it's about public opinion, not about me and what I like. I guess we'll see next year what happens with public opinion. Okay? <clears throat> okay? All right. So, I have played this apology from Keemstar in its most honest, unedited form. Right? There's no way that you can say that I spun it in a way. I didn't comment on it. What I'd like to do is I'd like to actually take a look at what I post... <laughs> Right? It doesn't even show up. It's just blank. And at the time, so this was Wednesday night. 
you know, Andy and I were talking and we're actually kind of freaking out. We're like, uh-oh, like what just happened? Please don't tell us now something crazy is happening to this man just as, as we were supposed to be doing this co-op. So now, obviously, the entire internet's going to be like, oh, what happened? He's going to do co-op with you guys, and now he vanishes. Like, what did you do with him? Did you kidnap him? Did you throw him in a closet? No, like, we're not involved, right? We have nothing to do with this. We don't even know what the hell's happening. We're just as in the dark about it as everybody else. But, of course, we had to have our <laughs> our event canceled right before all this, this crap happens, right? So, uh, basically, yeah, his account is gone. And everyone on the internet is freaking out about this, right? Wondering what's going on. Well, yesterday... <laughs> she... Got your ass. You understand? I hold the cards now. So, I control the situation, not you. I have all the power here, not you. So it's either 50 grand or nothing. 50 grand or I'm not going to be on your show. But I do have another offer for you. You appear here on my Level 1 podcast. For free. You don't have to pay to be on my show. You can be a guest on my show. And we'll have a conversation live. What do you think about that? Now here's the thing. In order to actually have that happen, Team Star would actually have to find a way to lower himself to my level on level one. Because usually what he does is he'll go on his Twitter and he'll scream and be like, blah, 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 blah. I'm not going to be following you on Twitter. I'm not going to, if you actually literally go on Twitter right now and say, I accept, I don't give a fuck. You actually have to contact me like a man, like a business transaction, which is what this should be. Not you screaming like a child on Twitter and acting like an immature child. I want you to actually like contact me via a method that makes sense. What are they, vegetables or? Ale? It exists. I have email. Right? Twitter. I do have a Twitter account. You're blocked on there. All right. So what I will do now, just to show good faith. The wrong mouse. To show good faith, I'll go and I'll unblock Keemstar on Twitter. So if he actually wants to send me a DM about appearing on this show, all right, we can talk about it. And by the way, I'm just going to tell everyone, I'm not guaranteeing that this is going to happen. This is, could just, you know, you know this guy and his behavior. You know I don't like him. So, very well, this could just fall apart immediately and never happen. And that's okay if it does. All right? I'm not expecting anything out of this. All right? But, you know, you want me on your show, you got to pay the king's taxes. It's just that simple. All right? So, 50 grand, and I'll be on your show for two hours. Or, we could talk about... You appearing on my show, The King's Court, you're going to have to lower yourself down to level one if you actually want to have a real conversation with me. Don't post on Twitter about it. Are you sure about this? I don't care. If you do, I'm going to ignore you. Don't make any counter offers. I'm going to ignore them. It's my way or the highway, bro. So let's hear what you have to say about it. Okay. <clears throat> All right, we have one more topic for today. I saved the worst for last, that's for sure. By the way, guys, over 700 viewers, 290 likes. Let's get some likes going. Let's get some likes going right now on the stream if you're enjoying it. All right, and please, let's get some support going. Like I said, I want to hit at least my tier two tips goal by the end of the stream. We haven't had a tip in like an hour. Let's get a tip going. Let's get that 100 bucks, all right? Shout out to Some Kind of Taco. Who did a super chat and said, So many YouTubers have come and gone, yet the king, despite having so many people against him for over a decade, has remained. May he stay blessed. All right. And thank you also, Don McLean, for another super chat. Keem looking like Kevin Nash at the summer of 92 right now. There you go. Thank you, Don. Let's get Don on the leaderboard again. And then we got our final topic today, which is going to be pretty interesting because, ladies and gentlemen, I have a new segment to introduce to him as. The Kino Casino boost will only last so long. Focus on creating content we're here for rather than spotlighting any more drama. Even if it's vindicating, this is all feels like bait. I'm loving your main content. Let's focus on that. That's an interesting opinion. I appreciate that. And thank you also for the $3 tip there. Uh, in addition, I received a $5 tip from an anonymous tipper. Would you talk to Keemstar on your own podcast? Well, let's... Uh. Skill. 
hold on. I haven't responded yet, right? I haven't. Let's continue. Let's keep going. And then, you know, I, I you know, I know what I, I have my piece to say, but let's get to it, right? I don't know if you heard about this thing. It's called suspense. <laughs> Plus, I'm really enjoying these comments. Let's be, I'm actually having a good time with these comments. By the way, this isn't the final topic of the show. We're actually going to talk about duty after this topic. But, you know, because duty is the least important thing. That's why I left them for last. Um, He's bowing down. I say yes. No, it's bait. I wouldn't trust Keem ever. He's just going to try a new grift on you. Yes, thumbs up. Here's Booker T when he was the king. Do it, king. Yes, sir. Of course, respond, Phil. Don't trust him. It's bait. He's trying to bait you into something you'll regret. Keep up what you're doing. Hell no, Keem is seething. I would. This is massive. It's below the king to entertain such petty try. Stop it. Get some help. Worthless specimen. Get that ass banned.